cowardly foul bumpkins that will take hell all of them. Well, you've been gone for quite a while. I have been to several worlds in search of these pumpkins the superior was talking about. <laughs> and? I was looking for the vile, vicious creatures that Semnus described. Do you know how many times I was laughed at when I offered to vanquish pumpkins? Oh, that was quite nice of you anyway. It wasn't until I overheard two children talking about waiting in a pumpkin patch for some creature to appear that I had some indication of what I was looking for. Even when I made a discovery that I was looking for an oversized squash, I had to fight my way through these children who worshipped what they called the Great Pumpkin. Children? <laughs> How brave of you, Diviner. Hey, you weren't there. They were incredibly resourceful. The one that appeared to be their leader attached himself to my leg, pleading and crying loudly. It was very irritating. I'll bet it was. But you finally got one, I see. I had to get past a dog who thought himself to be a warrior of some kind. I can only imagine he was making engine sounds and trying to shoot imaginary guns at me. It was quite hard to tell, seeing as though he was a dog. I suppose you'd better get your hard-won prize the superior then. Regale him with your tale of woe and <laughs> fighting off children. And dogs. Fighting with kids and dogs and stupid pumpkins playing barely well at her. Ah, a pumpkin. Yes, sir. As you ordered. Did I? Yes, sir. You ordered me to find a pumpkin so that you could decide whether or not it should be slaughtered for the official organization pie. Oh, that. I thought it was a hallucination. I wish it were, Superior. You look as though you haven't slept for some time, Sykes. I've been searching for several days, sir. I don't believe there are many worlds with pumpkins. Oh, that is a shame. They used to be thick in Radiant Garden. What? Radiant Garden, where my somebody was from, you know. Pumpkins all over the place. Couldn't get away from them. You had to kick them out of your way walking down the street. Some of them would attempt to kick back, but lacking limbs, it was rather difficult for them. And you don't suppose you could have told me this before I left your assigned mission? I assumed you knew that pumpkins couldn't kick. I meant about them being so plentiful in Radiant Gardens, sir. A place we've been, where there are no whining children and strange dogs. Oh, I, I thought I did. We were sitting at a large table playing cards with Socrates and some fellow who used to write a lot of nonsensical overappreciated literature. Shake... Shake something. Shake spoon, I think. I was up 300 money and you had just one large talking donkey and a floating, glowing object of some sort that sang songs by a man named Bon Jovi. I believe that means good Jovi. I believe that part was the hallucination, sir. Oh, that's a terrible shame. I was getting along with that shake something fellow. He said I was the most beautiful girl at the dance. Between you and I, Sykes, I think he was a bit of a pervert. If you don't mind, sir, the pie. Oh, yes. I suppose I should officially declare our official pie. Uh, officially. I'm sure we would all be quite grateful. Was that it? I don't think it needs much ceremony, do you? No, 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 no. So long as it's over. Of course. Save the tradition of declaring the official pie of the organization dance. Oh, wonderful. The theme will be enchantment under the sea. You may call me Lorraine Baines, and I will meet you when you fall out of a tree while watching birds. But really, you will be watching me. Uh... Sir? I would advise against that. If you go through with your plans, you will change the future. Ah, oh, well then, never mind. Do you ever get the feeling that everyone around you is crazy? It's really best not to think about it. Your love is like bad medicine. Bad medicine is what I need. Oh, shake it up, just like bad medicine.